If you're thirsty for music, I got your fix. All right, so look, I came across some headphones phones while I was in the checkout line because I don't know why, but there, it was there. I didn't even know this was a product. I didn't know anything about this until I was in the store, but it's so, and I like seeing weird. Coca-Cola, everyone knows Coca-Cola. Everyone knows Pepsi, Coca-Cola, this, that, and the third, whatever. But Coca-Cola made some headphones. Coca-Cola made some headphones. actually like really weird to me. I don't know why. But I was intrigued by it, so I had to get it. It was only 15 bucks. I don't know how much it initially cost, but for $15, I couldn't pass it up. Uh, let's see. Easy pairing with most devices, which means it only works for certain things. 30 feet, 10 meter range. It's a can-shaped charging case. Pretty cool. Can't wait to see what that looks like, how big it is. Playback time, 7 hours. Charging time, 2 hours. And standby, 100 hours. Bluetooth capabilities and travel charging case. HD stereo sound. We'll see about that. And yeah, just by the thing, you can tell it's like a little Coke can. It just pops up. Kind of like some Jurassic Park stuff going on. Not here though, but yeah. Coca-Cola, truly wireless premium ear. The True Buds. So let's get to it. Alright, so here we are. Full headphones, everything has them on the back. It's magnetic, it's pretty cool. USB-C, charging case, wire buds, etc. They are left, right. It's magnetic, pretty cool, like how that Polaroid was. This does not make typical, just small USB-C cable. Too serious, nothing. A little startup guy because who knows who doesn't know how to use headphones? Not me. So let me read a piece of shitty paper on shitty font on 100% expired. So, so it might actually fit me. Oh, automatically, the next opener is actually the USB C. That's cool. That's on the bottom. Just maybe I am. Maybe I don't know. How, I don't know, like what was Coke doing. Like you know what? Coke was like you know what? Who doesn't? It popped right up. Coca-Cola True Buds. It's pretty cool, man. That's so fucking neat. Hey, connected already. That's actually pretty good. And fast and quick. I don't have Apple Music, but I have YouTube Premium, so I'm gonna just listen to some YouTube Premium real quick. They fit nice, but I can see them being kind of annoying because it's just, it's kind of like shitty plastic. But who knows? Let's find something to listen to and figure it out. Um... These are a no. For $15, I can't bitch and complain, but these are a no-no for me. Uh, let me try to get the other one paired, because that's the problem I might be having. I'm not sure. Um. Hmm? These are weird. Like, hold up, wait. Because you have to connect them both, which is not ideal. Let's try this again. A different song. Let's do... Alright, we're just going to cut it there. If you have the chance, buy them, but if you don't, don't go out of your way. They're terrible. I was playing one song, and it was skipping between each one. It was going track, track, track. It's actually pretty, like, a decent thing. Here, listen. It might show you. I don't know if you can hear that, but that's actually, like, do that again. Because it's pretty decent how they, like, do it. They say, oh, which one's connected and which one's not. That's actually pretty decent and neat and different. But you have to connect them both at the same time. That's weird. I never, I never had to do that with any ear, earbuds I ever had before. Like I said, I just bought it for the novelty just because it was a Coca-Cola one. They automatically connect once you, like, pair them together and, like, take them out of the case. Out of your mini Coke can. It's just saying Bluetooth pairing mode has been powered off. But, yeah, don't go out of your way to get these. But you have a chance to get them, 100% get them just to mess around with them and see how they are. But for me, they're a no. I need a little bit more bass, a little bit more connectivity. They're kind of like... Mm, I'd rather have dollar general headphones versus a Coca-Cola headphones. But it's the novelty that's pretty cool. So now I have a mini Coke can that I don't know what to do with. Because I'm never going to use these headphones again. Uh, maybe I'll just throw the headphones away and just give the can to my kid. Who knows? So what do y'all think of the Coca-Cola headphones? Let me know in the comments down below. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one.